Hey, it's Jim Dory. With me is Ethan Schur from Hi. TD Vision. And uh, just going to ask him a couple questions and uh, fill in our readership. So, Ethan, I uh, hear there's something going on with the format war. Yeah. Well, can you tell us a little bit more about that, the differences between the different formats? And... Right, so there's different formats for taking 3D to the high. So what's the goal? We have our source content, which is 1080p per eye. 1080p left, 1080p right. How do we take that to the home? Okay. So what do most people do to take 3D to the home? They take the left, they take the right, and they squeeze it to a single 1080 frame. What does that do, though? That cuts the resolution of both frames in half. Obviously, if you try to squeeze something twice as big into something one times as big, you're going to lose half your resolution. Then they need a special chip to stretch it out in there. Okay? That's what most people do. This technology has been around since the 1970s. It's not anything new. You lose half your quality. Let me ask you a question, Jim. What happens when you look at a side-by-side -side image formatted on a TV that doesn't have a 3D chip, just a regular 2D TV? It's blurry. Well, you're going to see side-by-side, -side, exactly. So it's not 2D compatible. You need an extra chip, and you need to have your resolution. Okay? So what do we do? We have the left view. We have the right view. To be the closest comparison, we can take what's called the delta. Okay, that's the difference between that market. We store that in the video stream. This way, if you broadcast it, a 2D television will see the 3D information say, I don't know what to do with it. It's just discard that information. So it ignores it. Right. A 3D television can play it back in LCD, DLP, etc. Any different format, up to 1080p. So this is what we are doing. Our company is called TD Vision Systems. And if you look on the website for ISO, JVT, or MPEG, you'll see that our technology is core to the MPEG MVC multi-view uh, standard, which is actually being put forth by Panasonic. So RIP is actually at the core of that. Awesome, awesome. So when we're talking format war, you're saying some of the competition, if not all of them, are not following the standard? Uh, no, I mean, companies have their own proprietary standards, and, and we have always tried to be compatible with MPEG. We've always tried to be backwards compatible with 2D and forwards compatible with 3D systems. So our Blu-ray discs and broadcasts, they don't break MPEG systems. They're fine. Okay. Very good. Thanks for your time, Ethan. Thank you. Appreciate it.